Hi, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Cambria, and I just want to kind of hop on real quick and do as quick as possible my best beauty buys of 2021. Um, so these can be brand new items, new launches, or even old and tried and true products. But these are the things that I purchase and repurchase and repurchase. So if this is something that you want to see, then let's get to it. Okay, so the first line that I have to have, to, I've used this on a daily basis, morning and night, and it's a complete line. I love it. And also, it's black owned. So I have to really give props to Shandy Darden. This line is found in Sephora, but it is great for all skin types and it doesn't have any fragrance. So I know there's some people with sensitivities with, there's a thing with fragrance. I absolutely love it. So this is the cleansing serum that I absolutely love. I also have her Saki Toning Essence. Smells amazing too. I also have, she just released this this year, but this is the Intensive Eye Renewal Cream. Love it. I have, I use retinol every day, the retinol reform. And then she also have something called texture reform, which is more for sensitive types for um, retinol. And this is something you do have to build up to for skin tolerance. You use it first once a week, then you move it to twice a week, then you move it to three times a week. So now I use it on a daily basis. I love this stuff, love it. And then last but not least, I have the Weightless Oil-Free Moisturizer. So I use everything here. It's amazing. My skin looks flawless. It looks even better now than it did prior to me using this line. And yes, it is a little pricey, but it's not crazy. And I think if you're gonna invest in anything, invest in your skin. <laughs> so that's what I have there. Also, just sticking with skincare, two things that I have bought over and over and over again. These are from Glow Recipe, and it's one is the Plum Plump Hyaluronic Acid. As you can see, I'm almost done with it. So I have another box ready to go. This is absolutely amazing. And then I also use the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow niacinamide dew drop. So I use this only in the daytime, but it gives a natural glow to your finish and it smells amazing. So I love these both. Glow Recipe actually has a great line and I actually use all their products, but the ones I'm really hopping to Sephora or hopping to their website to get are these two. So love, love, love. So I do, if anyone's seen my previous videos, I'm a mask core a little bit. I love mask. And the new one that I absolutely love that I found literally just a couple weeks ago is the new Key Soul Care Harmony Mask. So this is by Alicia Keys. This line can be found at Ulta and it is amazing. Um, I Just so you know, can see what it looks like inside. I've been using it quite a bit. It's a little on the darker side, it's like a gray tone there, but it is amazing. It dries really nicely on your skin. You can actually see it working on your skin and it it's so easy to come off. So I absolutely love this for a mask. So this is one of my newer masks that I love. When it comes to body care, of course, when you're African-American or dark skinned um, and you have to deal with summer, you're definitely gonna deal with ashiness and you know, so I don't wanna deal with any of that. So this lotion from Glow Recipe, this is their Watermelon Glow Pink Dream Body Cream. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely amazing. It is light, even though it comes out really thick, when you put it on your body while it's still wet, it absorbs like a dream. It doesn't leave an oily film behind and it smells awesome. So this is, and this is in Sephora. It's only $26. So I was shocked at the price point 
and this is for how many ounces um it doesn't say on there i think this is 12 this is 8 point nope 11 fluid ounces so 11 fluid ounces but this does the job so i absolutely love love this for a lotion and then my tried and true drugstore brand the olay body rinse off conditioners i love these i use these in the shower on a daily basis every time I re-up at Walmart, I get six to seven of these because they're only $4. And I get them in all different flavors and it is amazing. It soaks in that moisture and helps with the application of a lotion. So when you use these two together, bomb, especially in the summertime, so. Okay, and then for kind of like facial grooming, um, I do dermaplane my skin, so. For those who don't know, that's really kind of exfoliating your skin by taking off the excess hair and then sometimes just a light layer of skin that comes off when you technically shave. So I absolutely love these, even though I got one out. <laughs> um, it's actually right here. So this is the one that I've been using, but these are the Chic Hydro Silk Touch Up Razors. And I mean, I think it's because of the angle if you can pay attention to that angle there, it does an amazing job. I do my eyebrows with this, like I don't get them tweezed or waxed. So I use this and then I use this for dermaplaning my face. And when I dermaplane my face, it actually makes the application of makeup a lot smoother. I don't have to use as much. The tone of my skin actually matches. So, and I got these from Amazon for only like $3, but you can get any, type of dermaplaning tool like from the local beauty supply place or walmart or target i just particularly like these so this is the one from chic okay and then the last thing is protection from the sun because again i live in a desert but even if you don't you're supposed to be wearing sunscreen every day i use quite a lot of sunscreen and so far um the one that seems to work the best for me i've used sprays i've used lotion me and my family we love the banana boat. This is their Ultra Sport 50 plus SPF UVB protection. This uh, is amazing because it actually does not leave a cast. It does, it smells amazing. It actually doesn't smell like SPF. And you can layer this on top of lotion. So like when I use my Olay and then I use my, you know, glow recipe, then I put this on top or I can mix them together. And this does amazing. And as you can see, I don't know if you can see, but it's only up to here. So it lasts longer than the sunscreens. So just saying, <laughs> just saying. So that's kind of like just a quick overview of the things that I'm loving so far in 2021 in beauty. Um, the only thing I wanted to mention, even though it's technically makeup, which I don't want to get too much into because that's a whole nother category, but the best find that I've had so far with makeup. So if you're watching this and you don't know what this is by now, that's a problem. This is the Maybelline Sky High Mascara. I'm actually wearing it right now. I don't know if you can see. Um, let me get closer. <laughs> but this makes you look like you're wearing falsies easily. I don't have to wear false smith. And the wand is amazing. I don't know if you can see. Let's see. The wand here is super long and it's bendable. See how flexible it is? It's super flexible. Look how much came off just by doing that. So when you're actually using it, it like grabs every single thing without you having to go through so many passes. So I wanted to really bring that to the forefront. So not gonna get too much into makeup this time, but if you don't have this, you better go grab it. Maybelline always does the best when it comes to mascara. You don't have to pay a lot of money for it. So that's all that I have. That's all for the video. Hopefully you liked what you see. You can also comment on things that you love and maybe I'll take a look and say, oh, maybe I should try that. So comment, like, subscribe below. And again, definitely be safe out there. Please protect yourself, wear a mask, and hopefully, hopefully, hopefully you're able to get vaccinated, okay? Talk to you all soon. Bye.